Hey guys, it is the Battle Productions, and welcome to another part of Pokemon Reversion. In the last part, um, we took on this route over here, and, uh, well, we got to this, uh, Mount Moon place, and in this part, we're gonna go in it. Off screen, I bought six repels, so I'm gonna be using them in, uh, Leaf Drift, well, of course, in this Let's Play, but, um, I'm just gonna be using them in here, too, so. I don't have, uh, it really hurts me, you don't have a lot of money, because... I don't want to spend all of it, so I decided to buy um, buy repels with half of it. Anyways, we got Team 09 Bullet Seed, which probably it would be a good move for Bulbasaur if you if you pick Bulbasaur. And also, there's a Paralyzed Heal over here. And now I this trainer here, and I'm gonna see what my Pokemon. Okay, so uh, yeah, I'll put Charmander up top. The Charmander needs to evolve. All right, it's been a several parts since we got him, and he needs to evolve at least once here. So this is suspicious men are in the cave. What about you? What about me? What? I'm just a normal kid going around with a red hat. I mean, every trainer has that pretty much. Come on, game. So that's all right. We're gonna face Bug Catcher Kent. He gets it out of Weedle, but I don't care. He's gonna Ember. And that should be a KO. And we're gonna probably get to level 16 here. And we do. So now we're gonna evolve after this after this battle. I was gonna say in Kakuna. Do I yeah, you know what? I'll send out Porky. I mean, I just yeah. Just go for rock to oh, I miss. Come on, make it. Okay, thank you. No, I keep. You know what? Some scratch until it dies. Oh, one HP. Gosh. All right, there we go. And now, what? Char batteries evolving. Uh, go go. Yes. So what is he going to turn into? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Uh, and oh my gosh, you look familiar. Oh my gosh, it's a Charmeleon. All right, good for you. And now let's just get Porky up top here. Because this girl over here will have a couple Clefairies, so. Yeah, what? I'm waiting for my friends to find me here. Well, I don't care. And now here is... Last Iris, and she's gonna set out a Clefairy. No, this is not Iris from the fifth generation. I wish it was, though. Uh, that means we beat a champion from a different region in the future. That, that should be pretty cool. But whatever. And Porky did not level up. I lost? Oh my gosh. Who would say that? I mean, that, that, Nintendo could have come up, came up with that. Like, something better than I lost? I and mean, that's horrible. Oh, Repel wore off. Starting to wish this was black too, because it automatically gives your. It's like, oh man, it automatically asks if you want to spray another repel, which is actually really nice. Anyways, let's face this Team Rocket. You're on. We, Team Rocket, are Pokemon gangsters! We strike fear with our strength. Ah! Oh well, whatever. I'm gonna defeat this gangster here. Such a noob. I'm just gonna low kick it. And then I'm just gonna karate chop and uh, take it down eventually. There you go. Porky grew to level 15. Now it's time for a Raditza, so I'm just gonna take it down. And now, let's see what his next Pokemon is Zubat. So I'm gonna send out my awesome new Charmeleon. Now I'm gonna Ember. And there we go. We defeat the Rock Grunt. I blew it! Yeah, you did blew it. Or, oh, not. That's a past tense word. I mean, yeah, you did blow it. There you go. That's how you're supposed to say it. I mean, like, Summer's really punching me in the face right now. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to school next year, but that's alright. It's next, no, next grade. But anyways. <sighs> okay, let's just get out of here. So, alright, now let's go down here. And there's a scientist, scientist guy, and he's like, What? Don't sneak up on me. You came towards me. I did not come up behind you and talk to you. Oh well, it's time for Jovan to send out a Magnemite. So I'm just gonna send out my man, Porky! And now it's time for a Voltorb, but I don't care. Cause Porky can do the job. He always does the low kicks pretty well. And now Porky grew level 16. He's trying to learn Fury Swipes. Eh. Uh, well, Fury Swipes, very inaccurate, but it can go from two to five times. No, it's gonna bite me in the butt in this Let's Play, so I'm not gonna do that. My Pokemon won't do! Oh, now let's get this here. 
and we get a potion. I mean, look at this, does this look like it's like well, no? Okay, I should probably just stop walking. Okay, does that look like water pouring out of the, like the rocks? No, they just stuck it on there. They didn't give it any animation whatsoever. You'd think they would do that, but that's all right. I mean, it's not a big deal, but still, they, just gosh, come on, game freak. Anyways, now there's a person up here, a bug catcher, so I'm gonna have to put Charmeleon up top. So let's do that. You need to go through this cave to get to Swirling City. I don't care, I'm just gonna kick your butt. Okay, it's a little Robbie, but I'm just gonna take it down. Take him down, not take it down. And now it's time for more stuff there. There we go, we defeat Robbie. I lost. Oh my gosh, what's with the all this dialogue saying I lost it just sounds like I'm <sighs> whatever just forget about it now go here we get an escape rope so now I can leave the dungeon if we like for, like need to heal up Anyways, I'm excavating for fossils here under Mount Moon sometimes Brock of Pewter Jim lends me a hand alright so now here's the last Wow, it's way bigger in here than I thought. It's actually pretty small, but okay. Good for you. And now it's time for last. Miriam. Mer Miriam? Miriam? Uh, whatever. Let's just take down her Pokemon. And try me on girl level 17. Now she's gonna send a Bell Sprout. I'm just gonna take it down. The usual. Let me defeat it. Oh, I lost it! Oh my gosh, what's with that? But whatever. I'm just gonna use my rare candy on Charmeleon, so now he's at level 18. Yep. And I'll just put Porky there, and let's go through here. Oh, a repel wore off. So we have two repels left, but I think that should last us through this cave. Now you can actually get this item without battling him. It's TM46 Thief, but I don't care. I'll still battle this guy. We need some training, because the next gym's gonna be pretty hard. Anyways, here's uh, this Team Rocky Grunt. What a noob. But I'm just gonna. Oh, intimidate. I'm just gonna go for Rock Tomb and take it down. There you go. So you are good. Yes, I am good. Now, if you talk to this rock, you get an ether. Pretty good. And let's just keep going. And I think this guy has a. Uh, uh, Raditz, I'm not too sure. Uh, yeah, Raditza. I was actually correct for once. I should get a ribbon for that. Anyways, I'll get Raditza. I'm just gonna take that down. Now it's time for Zubat, so I'm just gonna go for another Rock Tomb. Oh, I missed! Come on, stop missing. But there we go. Let me defeat Josh. And yeah, I don't know why I'm super speeding, but that's alright. I mean, this cave's kind of big, but it's not at the same time. It's just very time consuming. I mean, eight minutes, and I'm not. Well, I am almost done, but still. Alright, let's face this hiker. Whoa, you shocked me. Oh, you're just a kid. Oh, I'm just a kid, eh? I'm just gonna kick your butt in a battle. Time for Marcos. So I'm just gonna spam Karate Chop at him. Porky Riddle level 17. And now it's gonna Karate Chop him again and take him down. Now it's time for Onyx. So let's go for the low kick. And critical hit, that's pretty good. And we defeat Markers. Wow, Markers. Marco, wow, shocked again. There you go. Now you can get an item over here, and it is a moonstone. So now you can evolve your Nidorino if you get one. Or Nidorina, I don't care. Now uh, our repel wore off, so let's get another repel. I don't, I don't think that could last us, but that's alright. Um, there's nothing over here, so let's go this way. Little kids shouldn't be messing around with grown-ups. It could be bad news. Whatever, I'll just kick your butt. Okay, so now, the Raditza, don't care. Now it's time for a sand shrew, so I'll just use Karate Chop until I kill it. Oh, critical hit, there you go. I'm gonna defeat the rocket grunt. I'm steamed! Okay, good for you. Also, down here, you can get a new Pokemon, and that is uh, Clefairy. Well, actually, um, well, Geodude's a new Pokemon, so is Zubat, but... A Pokemon that's pretty rare is Clefairy here, and Clefairy, it's a pretty good wall. That's all I can say. So if you need a, a wall, you can use Clefairy, because you can also use a Moonstone to evolve it to Clefable, which is actually a pretty good move too, but 
Um, you don't, like, literally, um, I wouldn't evolve it until later in the game, but that's alright. We, Team Rocket, shall find the fossils. Reviving Pokemon can give us riches. Alright, good for you, and I'm just gonna take you down. Alright, so Porky grew to level 18. Now it's time for a Zubat, so let's send in Charmeleon. And take it down. Yes, we can take it down. Ah, I'm mad. Okay, good for you. And let's switch around Charmeleon and Mankey. And there's also a hidden item over here. If you go to the right and talk to this rock, you get another Moonstone. So now you can get either both of a Nidorino, Nidorina Evolution, or you can get one of the Nidoran Evolutions and a Clefable or a Jigglypuff. I mean, there's so many options with this Moonstone. So it doesn't matter. I mean, like, if you find two, at most, you probably only, you'd probably only use two, but... I know some people like getting all the Pokemon, so they do that, but... If you were gonna do that, I'd recommend trading. Alright, so now it's time for this guy. Hey! Stop! I found these fossils, they're both mine. Way to be greedy, dude. Okay, so now it's time for Super Nerd Miguel, and he's gonna send out a Grimer, so I'm just gonna spam member until I, get, I take it down. Okay, so now it's time for coughing. Uh, hopefully I can take that down. Ah, oh, poison gas. Ah, uh, crap. That's all right. And now Voltorb. Let's just take it down quickly. Okay, so it's gonna charge. Doesn't matter. And Charmeleon will get to level 19. Okay, I'll share. Okay, good. But now I'm gonna have to heal up Charmeleon. I still want it to get um die. You know. Anyways, here's the Helix fossil and the Dome fossil. Helix fossil gives you an Ammonite, which is a star like. Uh, star Pokemon and um, Dome Fossil is for Kabuto, which you can get Kabutops. Uh, Kabutops is offensive, and uh, Ama Star, which is the evolution of Ammonite, is a defensive wall. So it just depends on what you want. Uh, I'm okay, I'm just gonna probably go with a Helix Fossil because it's a defensive wall. I won't use it in my team, but still. All right, then this fossil is mine. Okay, I don't care. Now let's get out of here. Ooh, what's this? Oh, an antidote. Yeah, they just gave you one. I probably should have just did that, but that's alright. Let's get out of this dumb place. Here we go. We're out of Mount Moon. Now, welcome to Route 4. So over here, you can get... There's these two dojo guys. And I didn't talk to this guy. A punch of roaring ferocity! Packed with destructive power! When the chips are down, Mega Punch is the ultimate attack. You agree? Yes? Now let it teach me to your Pokemon! This move could be only learned once, is that okay? Then what Pokemon can learn? I'm gonna give it to Charmeleon. And I'm gonna get rid of Growl. You only can use him once, like each of these guys. Anyways, you can get Mega Punch over here, Mega Kick over here. A kick of brutal velocity! Packed with destructive power! And you get down right to it. Mega Kick is the ultimate attack, don't you agree? I gotta teach it to your Pokemon. Okay, so I'm gonna teach that to Porky. I think this is a really strong move, but it's inaccurate. Yeah, it's pretty inaccurate, but if you need something, if you need a really strong move, I recommend Mega Kick. This normal type move, which is unfortunate, I don't know why they wouldn't make it a fighting type move, but oh well. And now we use both of these guys up, so uh, I really normally was going to give Mega Kick to Mankey, but eh, it's the last second thought. So over here we get TM05 Roar, but why would I ever want that, so. Over here, you can never come back here ever again. Oh, wild encounter. You can never get back to Mount Moon ever again until you get fly or cut, which is later in the game. And also, here's a Spearow. Hmm. Nah, I don't need to get anything right now, but I probably will get one eventually. I'm not too sure about a flying type yet, so if you guys have any recommendations, just put them in the comments below. And you know what? I'm going to end it off here. So next time, well... We'll be going to the Nugget Bridge, so please leave a like, favorite, comment, subscribe, share with you in the box, and see you guys next time for some more Pokemon Leaf Green version.